Hello, I'm Nick Harris. I'm a recent graduate from the University of Gloucestershire in broadcast journalism. Um, so let's take a look at some of my work so far. We'll have Monday the 4th and Tuesday the 5th of June off this year to celebrate the Jubilee. But are people really that bothered about the monarchy anymore? Are they just happy to have the day off? Although there are mixed levels of interest, there is more excitement for the Jubilee in Gloucestershire than there was for the Royal Wedding last April. There were 85 Royal Wedding parties, compared to 171 applications for the Jubilee. And here in Presbury, where there'll be a huge barn dance, with a bar, a barbecue and loads of live music, the locals just seem to be getting in the Jubilee spirit. Hi, I'm Nick and here's your 60 second update. Gloucestershire University film students are finding it increasingly difficult to find jobs in the British film industry. I'm here at Regent Street in London at the film premiere of Killing Bono to find out what advice the fans have for our struggling students back at home. The City of London is the place for future British film professionals to make it. Although many don't, there are still thousands out there trying to find their big break. Crikey! It's all going to go down in one big chaotic haze. After the revolution, we're going to start. Um, uh, uh, hopefully splendid and happy after this. We'll see. When looking at your options, a lot of courses might come up in the search. You can filter them by where to study, course type and start dates to find the ones that you'd like the most. And he'll be a permanent judge on this year's X Factor UK. After a stream of female artists been brought in to guest judge on the programme, Simon Cowell is still struggling to make a decision on who'll be the fourth and final judge to join Louis, Talisa and Gary. Those in the running include Katy Perry, Nicole Scherzinger and British superstar Estelle. Thank you, Philippa. Yes, our Gloss Live tweeters have been talking all day about the arrival of the torch. Kirsty Scaperhorn says, I'm really looking forward to it. It passes near my house, so I'm hoping the traffic holds off so that I can get back in time. Steve Kitchen tweets, free party from three, labyrinth, sound checking and sounding good. Keep your tweets coming in to the hub and remember, hashtag Gloss Torch Relay. Back to you, Philippa. <laughs> really well. Seemed like there was a really good turnout, lots of noise, lots of fun. Really proud, really, really proud moment, I think. Yeah, really good. Yeah, Cheltenham's a really nice town, so I think it's, yeah, it's a really nice thing for it to come through, for everyone to have the opportunity to see the torch. Yeah, yeah. it's, it's, it's really not good. just a council, it's the whole country. Well, however you're spending your bank holiday weekend, make sure that you go out and enjoy yourself. This is Nick Harris reporting for Gloss Live. Well, I hope you enjoyed that. And if you want to get in contact with me, the details are at the bottom of the screen right now. Thank you.